Hi, I'm going to show you how to oil your valves on your brass instrument. It doesn't matter whether it's a trumpet, cornet, tenor horn, flugel horn. If it has valves like this, then this method will apply to you. Okay, so you'll need your instrument and some valve oil. Please don't use cooking oil or car oil or baby oil or any other type of oil except for valve oil. Okay, you can buy lots of different brands of it but it must say valve oil on the front, okay? You can get it from a music shop or you can buy it online. So once you've got your instrument and your oil, carefully unscrew the valve, not this top bit here, and lift it out. You should then be able to just squeeze a little bit of oil around the valve and then pop it back in exactly the same way as it came out, okay? If you turn it by mistake and it goes back in, you'll find that you can't get any air through your instrument. It comes, becomes blocked. So make sure that it goes back in the same way it came out and then simply screw it back together. There you go. Never force anything. If it doesn't feel right, unscrew it again and put it back in, okay? Just check the air is going to go through. Perfect. Now sometimes the valves continue to stick even after you've oiled them. So this might mean that there's something inside, a bit of dirt. Um, it might Sometimes it means that your valve is a little bit too wet as well. Maybe you've put too much oil in it. So we're going to clean the valve. So if you take your valve out completely, And then turn it upside down and unscrew the bottom valve cap as well. Okay, you might find there's a bit of muck in there that just needs wiping out. So, grab yourself a piece of kitchen roll or similar. Please don't use a tissue because the tissue will deposit lots of little tiny bits of fluff on there. So nothing too fluffy and just give it a white round. You might find all sorts of muck coming out of there. Quite satisfying. Okay, once you've done that, give your valve a wipe. And this should properly clean any bits off it. Okay. And then Place the valve cap back on the bottom of the instrument. Again, taking care not to force anything. Okay. And then place your valve back into the instrument the correct way round. And add a few spots of oil. You can oil the valve whilst it's out of the instrument but take care not to drop any on the floor. Give it a wiggle, check it's in the right way and screw it back in. Check the air goes through it. Perfect. If you've got any problems with your valves that you can't solve yourself or if you think it might be broken, please don't try and fix it. Bring it to your teacher and they'll sort it out for you.